video is not financial advice, so please do your own research and see what you want to invest into. Today we're looking at QuantoCoin at QuantoCoin.io. And this is what you hold in your bank in the palm of your hand. Imagine that your bank is in your cell phone right now. Pick up your cell phone and you have your own bank. Isn't that amazing? And if you're interested in getting involved and getting some tokens toward this, you can do so here. You can see the price of it and from the time of this video, it, the period ends in six days and three hours. You can purchase with Bitcoin, Ethereum, or credit card. So it's a revolutionary blockchain cutting edge banking platform for 3.8 billion people. And it's solving the problem of cryptocurrencies and banking by putting that right in the palm of your hand, right in your cell phone. You can see the token sales stages here with the private pre-sale, 18th to 30th of November 2017, the ICO, 1st of December to the 28th of February, and the DTO, July 1st to April 30th, 2019. So what is Quantum Core? It's a next generation model for the future of financial services and digital banking. It uses blockchain technology along with smartphones as well as a new kind of bio-identification system to ensure that it's safe and it's secure for all users. And it's a project ultimately to develop the future of the cryptocurrency world, the financial world. Its primary goal is to integrate and connect QTC into the traditional financial world and create a single gateway through the QTC platform for users, traders, investors, financial institutions, and a whole range of add-on services. It's a platform for the future of funding that's built on top of the Waves blockchain. And what's the current problem it's solving? The adoption of cryptocurrencies in the normal life. Now it's almost impossible to pay with anything with crypto for good or to do transfers. Also the transaction process for cryptocurrency against fiat is practically non-existent. If you take a look at the world today, even if you have cryptocurrency, you generally have to convert it into fiat or another cryptocurrency and there's a problem with that because you want to be able to use that currency to perform transactions or to do something outside of that coin state purpose. So what's the solution? QTC Bank with QTC Banking Platform. In the final stage of the QTC project will bring the solution by providing cryptocurrencies to mainstream everyday users. Imagine cryptocurrency being mainstream, being able to use it for everyday things, grocery shop, getting cash. We can see some of the functions here, a wallet, exchange, transfers, remittances, instant cash, cryptocurrency for everyday users, lending and <laughs> microfinancing, QTC lending protocol, social payments, high secure inner chat, crypto assets, portfolio, tokenized portfolio management algorithm. Geofencing, unique proximity functions, and the QTC mobile app it turns every smartphone into a sophisticated banking platform. And you can get it on Google Play once it's available. It is still under development and it's waiting for some regulatory approvals. But we can take a look at what it might look like here. Where you log in, you have your wallet, you have your news, but you're going to actually have your bank in your smartphone. It's going to disrupt banking with the various technologies it employs. We can see the QTC mobile app made for download via iOS or Android will make customers finally able to use cryptocurrencies to pay for any fiat-based goods or services instantly. We can see the QTC beacon, a small device usually powered via battery USB that emits a Bluetooth low energy signal. It's a modern smartphone in the vicinity that can pick up the signal by being emitted by a beacon to deliver quick, safe, and easy mobile-based proximity payment solutions. NFC, which stands for Near Field Communication. At the very basic level, it's contactless communication between two devices. In regard to payment processing, it's a technology that enables your phone to communicate with the payment terminal, point of sale, to initiate a transaction. And QR codes, quick response codes that have the ubiquity that NFC lacks. They won't be a bit old-fashioned barcodes, they're digital and give them the power to enable you to complete mobile payments. They also have a lending protocol, which is the next successful development, and this provides immediate cash by cryptocurrency pool, and contributors can now use the QTC mobile app to hold store the crypto assets 
without the need to sell them. Think about getting your own lending through your smartphone as well. Now you don't have to go to bank to get a loan. Also, you have a distributional token offering. We can see the information about the token here. Token name, Quanto Coin. Abbreviation, QTC. Blockchain is Waves. We have the initial price, USD, one dollar, two cent. We have the duration, the amount of token per period, and the amount of tokens. Basic principle, all coins will be sold during DTO. And how can you purchase them? Bitcoin, Ethereum, fiat payments. Settlement period is two to three days, and we have the DTO duration. You can see the allocation of tokens. 71.3% is distribution of the token offering. 18.5% is the initial coin offering. 8.5% is the team. 1.3% is the advisors. And 0.5% is the reserve. We can also see the allocation of proceeds. 53% platform development, 5% legal structuring, regulatory tax advice, 9% cost related to SW development, 4% maintenance fees, 15% management team, 3% community outreach, 4% bounty program, and 7% research. You can also see the roadmap here, where it started in February 2016 with white papers, legal structure, framework, establishment, and partnership, and where it hopes to be in 2019. Obtain banking license, integration with SWIFT system, hybrid application implementation for merchant functionality and own exchange facilities established. And to learn more about all this, you can look at the white paper, terms and conditions, privacy and cookie policy, the know your customer policy, and the legal memo. And you can see the amazing team members behind it. You can click on them, see their experiences, and connect with them on their various social media channels. You can also do the same with the ambassadors. This has also been featured on ICO Signal, The Tokener, ICO Alert, CNN, and ICO Marks, to name a few. And they've been featured in the media, which you can learn about here, with various partners, Ethereum, CoinGate, NetWar, NFC, to name a few. And to get subscribed to their newsletter, put your name and your email here and click subscribe now. Thank you very much for watching this review on QuantoCoin.